hit the bar. Anytime you see someone on the video boards, I need to see those kind of dance moves. As the Los Angeles Clippers prepare to take on the visiting Cleveland Cavaliers. Rodney, how do you feel first of all today? Uh, good, man, good. Another day, another opportunity. What's the uh, competition look like tonight against Cleveland? Tough, hard playing team. You know, uh, they, you know, they got a, a big win in Denver the other night, so I think they're still riding off. Yes. You know, they played the Lakers tough in the first half too yesterday, so right. I think they will come out pretty aggressive. Well, you know, I think they're out without Kevin Love. What are his thoughts on that? Will that make it easier on you guys, especially when they're in the back-to-back? -back? Right. It really don't make it easier, you know. It's the league, you know. Uh, we always preach every team preaches the next guy up, so I'm pretty sure that somebody's going to come in and try to fill that void. You know? What's the intensity like since you guys, you know, you had a, a letdown against the, the Me Memphis Grizzlies? Did that intensify you guys never to let your guard down? You can't let you go down any night. You're going to come. Every team is going to give us their best. Mm -hmm. No matter who we play, we have to come out and have the same mindset no matter who we play against as well. So I think that's just the approach we got to take. How's your assessment of the team's nucleus thus far? <laughs> still early in the season. Yeah, it's still early. I, I feel good. I feel good about where we are. You know, uh, we're still growing and still evolving. So that's good. What's the, the West is pretty tough. Yeah. Does that keep you guys, you know, really, really stretching forth and reaching higher every night? Uh, we, just, we just try to take care, of, take care of our business, you know, and really worry about, you know, things that we got to deal with and things that are in our hands and in our control. Obviously, you know, so we're just taking care of tonight. How do you block out the noise? Because I, I mean, you know, there's always radio, television articles, and how do you block out the noise of, from being distracted? Uh, just stay together. I would say that's, that's the main part. Just stay, stay together, and gaining each other's trust, and just building that communication with one another. That's how you really block out that noise because we're the ones going to war. You know? Right. So exactly. That's, that's, that's what really matters. Right. How's it being playing on this team compared to other teams you played on? Uh, it's fun though. Just that. I see the, the talent and stuff that we have on this team. Mm -hmm. you know, guys that really compete and we got all stars. So that's, that's a lot of fun. How does that enhance your performance? You know, because it says iron sharpens iron. So that make you sharper, more stronger, better, faster. Sure. So you, you see their approach, you know, and how they how they come into games, the preparation and stuff like that. So it kinda it kinda sharpens you that way as well, um, being a better pro. Right. What about the LA lifestyle? How's that? You know, I mean, besides the game, how is your adaptation to the LA lifestyle? It's been great, though. The weather's beautiful. You know, uh, it's just been you know a great organization too, though. So it just makes things that much better. I would say. Is it a dream come true to be playing on the West Coast where the weather is fine? Because I just talked to them, they said in Cleveland it's 60, and other right, places right. it's really it cold. Is, it is though for sure. Like, you know, <laughs> you can't ask for a better better setup. I would say. Right, right. Well, what would you say to your fans, friends, family? Uh, about what? Huh? Oh, just the uh, overall performance and the, 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 the support that you get and that, that are given to the Clippers. We appreciate it. Man. Just keep that pouring on. That's, that's the reason we've had this success thus far, you know, oh. um, being where we are because of the fans and everybody coming out supporting us. Right. Well, Rodney, closing out, you got any words of wisdom that you want to share with the people or yourself or your personal uh, motto that you live by? Keep your head up and hold on. Like, that's, all, that's all you can do. Just next day, next play, you know what I mean? Just, just be grateful and thankful that you have the opportunity to be where you are. You know what?